Hello, and in this video we're going to look at uh, the hydrolysis of nitriles to form uh, amides under both basic, we can do this under both basic and acidic conditions, and so we'll look at kind of a general example of that, and then I will give that the mechanism under uh, base, base catalyzed conditions. So a nitrile is a, is a, is a class of compounds that has the cyanofunctional group in it, or a, a C triple bonded to an N. And uh, either under acidic conditions or basic conditions, uh, we can form an amide. Okay, we could do hydrolysis either with H plus and H2O, or alternatively, uh, we could use hydroxide, say sodium hydroxide and water. Uh, H plus is probably going to equal, um, that could be H2SO4, could be toxic acid or our common uh, acids we would, would use for H plus. It could be H3O plus as well. Okay, and if we have mild conditions, it's going to stop at the amide. Uh, if we use uh, stronger conditions, it's going to get hydrolyzed. Uh, all the way to the carboxylic acid. Okay, and we've seen uh, this reaction before going from an amide to a carboxylic acid uh, that required six molar uh, hydrochloric acid, so con uh, relatively concentrated hydrochloric acid, not 12 molar, but still pretty concentrated, or 40% uh, sodium hydroxide in water. Uh, I'm going to indicate uh, more stronger conditions with, with heat, okay, for the purpose of, of this class. All right. Um, but I'm going to focus uh, right now on going from the nitrile to the amide. And I'm going to uh, show you the mechanism for how we can do that under basic conditions so sodium hydroxide and water. Okay, so uh, let's take a, a simple nitrile. Let's take acetonitrile. And the first thing I'm going to do is react that with hydroxide. And we're going to do this, and this is a nucleophilic addition step. And what that yields is this. Okay. We've got a negative char formal charge on that nitrogen. And so what we're going to do next is a proton transfer. We're going to protonate that nitrogen. Okay, and um, this gets us what's called the enol tautomer of the amide. And the next two steps, or the last two steps of this mechanism, are going to focus on to tautomerizing this to the amide, okay, and that's going to involve uh, two proton transfers, all right, in the first one, we're going to deprotonate or remove this hydrogen, and we're going to go down to here to do that, proton transfer. has two resonance forms. Try to squeeze this in here. 
touch three C C. Oops, gotta move over here. All right. Okay. And then uh, we can have a second proton transfer, which I'm going to have to kind of do up to here. And we're going to do uh, water for that. Okay. And that will ultimately get me to the product. Okay, which is an animal. Okay, so kind of in, in conclusion or summary, we had a nucleophilic addition followed by a proton transfer. And uh, then we had two proton transfers to get us from the uh, enol of the amide to the, to the actual amide, all right? And yeah, uh, this last proton transfer, you could show it from this resonance form or from this resonance form. If you're gonna show it from this resonance form, you need to have three arrows, one to bring this lone pair here and then one to pick up this hydrogen and a third to do that. So uh, you can use either resonance form for the final proton transfer. You just need to show the correct arrows when doing that. All right, and that concludes our video lecture on the hydrolysis of nitriles. Thanks for watching.